Thank you. Hi, everyone. So today I will uh, guide you how to archive and reference software source code with Software Heritage. So if you don't know Software Heritage, it's the universal source code archive and its mission is to collect, preserve and share all software source code because preserving our heritage is enabling better software and re better research for all. And to do so, you should prepare your code for better curation quality. This is not necessary, it's an, it, but it's better for you to have these files in your code so it can be indexed in software heritage. So add a readme file, a license file, an authors or citation.cff file to give credit to your uh, to the creators, to yourself and to the co um, other collaborators on your software and a codemeta.json file with complementary metadata. Then you can go to Software Heritage. We have a feature code sa the, called the save code now feature. And on this, um, on this page, you do choose the version control system and add a URL for your repository and you click submit and it will be in minutes uh, saved in software edit. It will save the complete development history. So all the branches, all the releases and each commit that you have done to this repository um, so throughout the project life. And then on Software Heritage, you can choose the granularity level you wish to reference using a suite to identify the snapshot, which will include all the branches, a revision, a release, a, di a specific directory, a file, which is a content, or even an algorithm, which can be a few lines in a specific file. And then you can add it into your citation to specify a specific code. Thank you.